Well, welcome to another edition of Market Wrap. My name is Paul Sibley from the Buxton Real Estate Group. We're here in another spring market, aren't we? Well, you certainly wouldn't know by the weather at the moment, but we are coming into a huge spring, as it always is. It's one of the busiest selling periods of the year. Certainly stock volumes come up and demand is out and about with the better weather and the better vibe out in the marketplace. Coming to you here is a special market wrap from the new Southland station. We're weeks away here from completion, certainly providing a number of options for commuters and local residents here. What a great spot here to be able to walk down from the local residences down here into your new station behind me. And healthy part of the auction. Another one going past behind us here, the Express from Cheltenham as well. It is only 25 minutes express from Cheltenham Station into the heart of the CBD. And Cheltenham Station is undergoing some changes as well where it's going underground. So that's gonna make that Charman Road intersection much better as well for the commuters to get through that, that little area. As I mentioned, spring is here. And if you're looking to book in your auction, please get in contact very soon. You're running out of weeks, I guess, to work out when you're gonna be sold and settled into the late half of this year and early next year. It's certainly always important to think about Christmas and wanting to be into your new home and settling before Christmas, maybe having the family over for a big Christmas day, or then into the early part of next year to get the kids into their new schooling. Well, we're right here in the heart of the footy finals and I often get asked at events or just around the area, when is the best time to sell? A very popular question. Really the best time to sell is when your home is competing with as few properties as possible. And that's really what's about the supply and demand equation. We have been very lucky, of course, throughout the year in terms of that there is a lot of demand, but not a lot of supply. So it's really been starved over and it's what is held the market up and about. There is a changing market out there at the moment. So what we're finding is that prices have been driven up so hard that that is not sustainable. Certainly conditions are really good with interest rates and the wider macroeconomic environment, but we are finding a shift in the market where we're getting a few less bidders at auction and that's certainly a normal, healthy thing to happen out there in the marketplace. So certainly more passing negotiates, a few more off-market sales and a few sales happening prior to auction as well. Some notable sales that have happened in recent times, a little focus here on the, uh, on the suburb of Hampton East for the notable sales. We've had three of those happen in recent times, three Sybil Street Hampton East, was a really good auction with three bidders. A lovely family secured the keys there and that was sold for 1,335,000. It was a three bedroom cream brick home. A lovely family sold that one to another new lovely family. So a lovely transition there. We just had a sale in Leonard Street, a beautiful four bedroom brand new townhouse that sold post auction for 1.39 million. And a record townhouse sale in Nepean Avenue at 1.55 million which is an exceptional result, sets a new standard, a new benchmark for the suburb. And it is a, certainly a tightly held pocket of Hampton East, close uh, walking distance to all uh, amenities. And it is growing in popularity along with Hyatt and the other beachside suburbs. Well, that's it from this month's market wrap. I'm Paul Sibley from the Buxton Real Estate Group. I really look forward to seeing you out there in the marketplace at open for inspections and auctions. And if you do have any questions or if you're thinking about buying, selling or investing, at the moment, I would be delighted to hear from you and I wish you a wonderful spring.